Hi everyone, this is my review of the Kensington iPhone, iPod, and mobile devices uh, car dock. And uh, give you a quick overview, uh, overview of it. I love the concept of it. Uh, it just plugs into your cigarette lighter, has a 4 inch flexible neck on it, and then a universal uh, holder for your mobile devices. And the way it accomplishes that is it's got this button on the back that you press, and it's spring loaded. And you just set your device in there. Squeeze it on and so it's universal and you can use any mobile device that you want to with it as long as it'll fit. And as you can see I got a first gen iPhone um, with a rubber casing around it and it holds it just fine. Like I said I love the idea of this car dock. Fortunately, as you can see, I got some rubber bands around it. Uh, give you a reference, I've got a 2007 Nissan Frontier, and this plug is longer than uh, the plugs on my Frontier. Uh, did some measurements. It was about one and eleven and sixteenth inches. Uh, this this uh, connector is, and the depth of my actual connectors was only about an, just a little over an inch on my actual truck <clears throat> so there's almost half an inch of this thing actually sticking out which if I don't put those rubber bands on there uh, this thing gets all wobbly and actually the weight of the iPhone will cause this to fall down like this so I unfortunately had to put rubber bands around it in order to give it that strength and that tightness it needed to be able to stay in place uh, other than that uh, I love it. I, I, using the rubber bands is a good enough of a fix that I'm going to go ahead and keep it. I'm not going to return it because uh, I really do like this this device. Uh, as you can see, my truck it gives me plenty of room from the iPod connector on my stereo to be able to just plug it in. And really, I, I love the device. It's great. It just unfortunately I don't know what model of car they were designing that plug for, but it definitely doesn't fit into any of my power plugs in any way shape or form and I'm gonna experiment with some some scotch tape or some electrical tape or some duct tape and see uh, what kind of thickness I can add to this to give it make it tight enough maybe it'll be better than the rubber bands that I'm using right now but other than that that's my quick video review of the Kensington iPhone iPod mobile devices car dock